Hi friends, welcome back to your channel, SciTechCore. In this, we are going to talk about the Moto H20 device. Is it worth to buy right now in the black variety sale in the Flipkart or not? The main reason is because right now the price of this phone got decreased by 2000 in the Flipkart. I'll try to show you exactly what is the price. As you can see, friends, 27,000 triple nine rupees. And few of the users they want to know whether this phone is a perfect choice to buy for this price or not exactly. So first, before starting the video, I would like to say some of the drawbacks in this device, what you can actually face. So first major uh, disadvantage in this device, which I thought of letting you know, is regarding the touch issues in this device. Yes, friends, uh, there's some kind of weird touch issues happening in the Moto H20 and till now there is no update uh, has been allowed in this device to fix this kind of issues. If you try to go to the ratings and if you try to click on the most recent uh, ratings, you'll be able to see. So a few of the customers saying about the having touch issues with the display. So a phone touch issues, as you can see, friends, there's so many complaints, not only in the Flipkart, you will, if you go to the Twitter account, you will be able to see in the Motorola page as well, saying all the tweets and commenting from the users facing touch issues. Yes, still touch issues existing in the Moto H20 and Moto team, they did mention that they will be providing the update as well on this device, but we are not sure when the update will be coming in the Moto H20 device. And right now I'm not using any kind of tamper glass. And without using tamper glass also you'll be able to notice little bit kind of touch issues but the moment you use tamper glass the touch issue problem will get a lot worse in this device and it's not possible to use like nowadays any smartphone without tamper glass right so you need to remember about those issues right now i'll try to show you the software update uh, still i did not receive any kind of updates as you can clearly see friends it's still running the september security patch update september so no updates yet in this Moto H20 device. So except that display touch issues is the one of the major problem in this device. So battery life and other things are secondary, but display is a main problem which is going on in this device. And next thing is about the network reception speeds. I mean, Wi-Fi network signal reception. It's not that uh, great when compared with the other devices. That's what I meant friends, because right now you'll be able to see the signal strength, how weak it is. So both phones are connected to the same Wi-Fi network, three bars I'm getting in the Realme X and Max, as you can see. And in the Moto H20, I'm getting only like one bar, as you can see, it's exactly, it's kind of really very low, very low system reception, as you can clearly see. And both phones are connected to the same Wi-Fi network. So you may think both are connected to different. And right now you'll be able to see friends, as you can clearly see, just now I did connect to the same Wi-Fi network, 2.4 gigahertz. So try to observe the signal strength. So 5 gigahertz, how much signal, 3 bars and 1 bar in the Moto H20 device. So we are getting signal strength as you can see. That's the one main, another uh, drawback is there in the Moto H20. So these are the few things which you should, you should definitely remember. So that's the reason instead of uh, saying those other advantages which everyone knows. So you should know this uh, disadvantages as well before you actually buy the device. That's what uh, my main idea because once you buy it and I'll be getting a lot of comments as well saying that uh, you said everything is fine but there are actually problems. That's the reason friends I need to show you all the proof. So what is going on? So apart from these two, I did not notice any kind of major problems. Yes, there is a battery backup uh, problem will be there. But if you do the gaming, then the battery backup problem will be there. I did not do any kind of gaming. So with the normal use, I was able to use this device for one day, no issues. And camera need to be a lot of improved as well. Camera is not great in this device at this moment. But overall, few things which I did like is talk your experience and less weight in this mobile phone. And watching videos is really good in this device. I can definitely appreciate watching videos okay watching videos and less white and stock ui no bloatware nothing these are the few things which i can definitely appreciate uh, in this moto h20 device so we should not take it for granted these things stock ui and uh, very slim profile and big display friends that's really fantastic to see this kind of slim profile and big display smartphone and right now the price is about twenty eight thousand. so try to do your research and try to follow the, my playlist which will be really helpful to decide whether it is uh, worth to buy or not make sure to follow my playlist for more in-depth videos as well till now the problems did not get fixed during in the wi-fi and the display that's it friends thank you for watching straight for more updates and meanwhile signing off and bye a oh, quick note apart from this there is no other issues friends in this device the performance is really good snapdragon 778g processor no issues regarding the performance so you should not be worried at all it feels like you are using the high-end processor i never felt any kind of slow in this device so thanks to this talk your experience and uh, there's a lot of ad other advantages like more 5g bands you can actually get in this device and apart from that there's nothing much major uh, to talk in this device so stock ui and slim profile of this phone and big display beautiful display apart from those touch issues while typing but while watching videos it's really good so that's it friends thank you for watching and see in the next video unless you have more updates and meanwhile signing off bye